My name is Tyler Justin Jaworski, and this was my workout for the day. Um, I started this workout out with a little bit of skills. I started off with some headstands, then did some planche stuff, and then some handstand balance. Um, as far as my strength on skills today, I just I literally didn't have it, man. Everything was terrible. I couldn't hold anything, and it's probably a product of my really poor sleeping schedule, which comes by way of uh, my work schedule, but there's really nothing I can do except for try my best and, um, you know, hope for the best. So anyway, you'll see my awful planche tuck attempts, like, if it wasn't for the P-bars being so high, I literally wouldn't even be able to get, you know, my feet off the ground, so I'm still worlds away from that. Handstand balance was kind of more of the same. I think I am getting better at keeping my legs closed and glued together, but as far as like the shoulder strength and the balance, it just uh, just wasn't there today, but we try again tomorrow. All right, I started this workout off with my second day of Small Love Junior on the front squats. And I think overall my form was pretty good today. This didn't really feel all that heavy. Um, this was seven sets of five at 205 pounds. Um, I got all the sets, all the reps. Um, I did have to change up my hands from the front rack style to the cross arms a couple of times just because my golfer's elbow was seriously flaring up. Um, one form change that I would like to make is I think my legs are too wide and I would like to close them a little bit more so it's more like an Olympic front squat and not so much like a powerlifting wide stance squat. Um, so after this, um, this was the first workout of my new program that I'm kind of working on. It's strength plus street plus hypertrophy. And so basically this would represent the street day. Um, and so basically what I started off with was just body weight exercises done in a superset fashion um, antagonistically. So vertical push and pull, horizontal push and pull, arms, and then, you know, some core. So I started this one off with pull-ups and I was going for sets of seven to 10 with the aim being able to get all 10. And then on the dips, I was going for 10 to 20, the aim being getting all 20. Now I did five sets of this and I was not able to complete all of them. So I'm gonna continue to work on getting all those sets and reps. The second superset was uh, body weight rows or Australian rows supersetted with diamond push-ups. The rows I was going for 15 and the push-ups I was going for 25, but it wasn't even close. These were way harder than I could have imagined. And I got 15 on the first one, but pretty much fizzled out to 10 on all the rest. I think what I'm going to do is drop one of the sets because I did five sets for everything. And I'm gonna focus on getting my reps at four sets and then I'll go and add the fifth set. Shout out to my cat who was chilling with me the whole time. Um, the last little superset I have here is just some banded side raises with straight arms as possible. Um, I really like these. I just wanted to change it up. I didn't feel like doing face pulls. Superset of that with ring curls, which for some reason, guys, and I'm a bodybuilder and I've done arm workouts my entire life. No exercise blows up my biceps like this one. Um, so if you have rings or a TRX, give it a try. After that, I moved into some uh, abs. So I did V-ups and then I did some support hold leg lowers. Um, overall, it was a pretty good session. I do think that it was too long. I don't know if I was just like messing around or my mind wasn't in it because I've been having poor sleep, but it is what it is. I got the work in. Um, and here's just a little physique update of me. Um, I'm still eating about 2,100 calories a day, doing intermittent fasting for the most part. Um, I mean, I'm happy with my, how my physique is looking. However, I would like to lose a little bit of fat. And the only way to do that is to just continue to stay consistent, um, stick to my diet, eat the right things, and let the time pass. Um, so with that guys, it's the end of the video. I'll see you at the next one.